The Florida Highway Patrol is an organization charged with enforcing the laws of the state, but it is also dedicated to promoting traffic safety and reducing death tolls and traffic accidents throughout the state. For some time now, the Highway Patrol has been energetically trying to get motorists to install seat belts in their cars and use them. Yesterday, two local troopers inadvertently but dramatically offered proof that seat belts can save lives and reduce the possibility of serious injury. Troopers E.C. Smith and Clinton Rhodes driving these patrol cars collided in a spectacular high-speed, high-impact accident while chasing a speeder in the rain on the North-South Expressway. After seeing the demolished cars, many persons have expressed surprise that the officers escaped with their lives. Smith suffered just a broken nose and facial cuts, Rhodes a bruised shoulder. These were not serious injuries, and highway patrol officers say they escaped death simply because they were wearing seat belts. The highway patrol naturally would prefer to demonstrate the value and effectiveness of safety belts in a less dangerous manner, but this accident should be a lesson for those motorists who are not now using seat belts. Remember, the 4th of July holiday is coming up, and the state and nation will once again be faced with carnage on the highways. Right now would be a good time to get belts installed in your auto, and of course you can have this done at most any garage, or you can contact your local Junior Chamber of Commerce organization. Many of these clubs are now actively engaged in installing seat belts at low cost. Remember, seat belts do save lives.